Well, hello and welcome back. It's been a minute, and we'll elaborate on that a little later in this episode, but we've moved back on a cloud for the summer season and checked back into our slip on Roanoke Island here on the Outer Banks. A few days ago, we saw a perfect forecast for a short sail and overnight anchorage, so we took the opportunity to refresh ourselves. I think out of all of us, scouts seem to enjoy it the most. were light and we dropped the hook behind the largest living sand dune on the east coast called Jockey's Ridge and we're soon joined by some friends for a sunset wrapped up in drinks. This was very needed after our hectic schedules through the spring. That evening, we cooked up some fresh sheep's head that I shot while spearfishing and turned in for the night. Well, good morning. Good morning. Where have we been? Uh, busy. Insanely busy. It hasn't even been a matter of us being like busy and then, oh, we're too tired to film a vlog or get some Instagram stuff. It's been like literally no time to create any content which is good and not good. So I do video production for a living, photography and video production, and summer is wedding season here on the Outer Banks. I shoot a lot of weddings and that's been crazy. I picked up a new client who has me shooting hotels across different states all around the country. Janie's laughing at Scout who's catching bugs in our cockpit. Good She'll job, Scouty. Her debut in a minute. I came to the Outer Banks as a professional organizer and COVID kind of messed that up for a while. So I'm working on building a virtual component package for that. But I have two other businesses. One of them is a printing, an art printing business. Um, I'm primarily on Etsy, but I also sell a lot in town. And I also manage Airbnb properties, uh, a couple of which are ours. So summer season for our service industry tourist destination started like two months ago, which Way early. didn't used to be the case. So we had to really put cloud projects and moving on to cloud and the whole transition on hold. Everything we're doing is with a long-term goal of long-term cruising and generating passive income for ourselves. A big part of that for us is Airbnb. We think that this is a really wise investment choice where we are right now at this moment in history. And we do want to talk more about that later sort of our, our goals and how we've done it and how we make that work. If you guys want to hear more about that or have specific questions, let us know in the comments because we're we're pretty into it. It's a big part of our story. Uh, we're not we're not a couple of trust fund babies here. We're very much self-made with our own businesses with a lot of effort, a lot of careful planning. We're making moves to to put that into motion so that we can do this lifestyle sustainably. I think we're doing it a little bit backwards from a lot of people that that we've seen doing this in that I, I feel like we see a lot of cruisers, not, not that one way is better than another, but we see a lot of cruisers who start cruising really early and then come back to find a home base and sort of settle down a little bit. I think we're doing the opposite where we're, we're trying to create our base first and then cruise so that it's kind of already set and ready when we come back. And because of short-term rental and where that is right now, having the base first is gonna allow us to fund this lifestyle moving forward. We enjoy talking about this. Um, and I think maybe whether or not you wanna hear it, we're, we're gonna end up talking about we it. We do wanna <laughs> open up more about financials and where we are. Well, we unfortunately do need to start heading back in typical summer fashion. Janie's got a house to clean. I've got a photo shoot at 10 a.m. There might be enough wind to hoist a sail, but we kinda just need to get moving, so. We're gonna lift this anchor up and get back to our slip. So thanks for your patience during our little hiatus during pure insanity. Like I said, everything's cool. We're fine. Cloud's still here. We still got her. All our plans are still intact. 
stay tuned because this summer we are going to be filming lots of sailing and we're also going to be filming a lot about our lifestyle like we mentioned before and how we make this work and I need to give a boat tour of our Bowman 36 so that's going to happen soon too. We really appreciate all the support we've gotten so far so please keep liking the videos, leaving comments for us and subscribe if you're not already subscribed because we've got a lot more cool stuff coming.